machine to keep going. Um, and without some guidance and some experience and some knowledge, um, I think we probably would have fallen down at the first level. Um, <laughs> yes, we would be fine because Nina is amazing and is an event manager. Yes. <laughs> Um, I have some flowers that Sam is going to give to Deirdre and to Rosemary to say thank you. Um, both mums are looking fantastic today. Um, I also want to thank um, my best man Sam who is giving the flowers and my as it were, main usher, Phil, who is sat here, Phil, could you stand up just a second, please? Phil and Sam, with the help of others, but 99% of this that you're looking at at the moment was Phil and Sam taking the time off of work to come and help me and Nina put up the bunting, the fairy lights, the hops, etc. So without you guys, um, this I would like to thank, um, and I'm, I, I apologise for sort of boxing you into this category, but I'm not going to go into all surnames. I would like to thank the Michelle family, and with that I mean all of the cousins and etc. that come underneath that. Um, you've been fantastic fantastically welcoming to me. Um, when I first met Nina, there were a few nervous times uh, coming around to yours. There was an incredibly nervous time when I went round to theirs and asked if I could marry Nina, where John <laughs> sat across me and went, mm, mm, let me just think about this. <laughs> um, I can't do Deirdre's voice, it's, it's horrendous. <laughs> but, um, yeah. The, the family has been fantastic, going around to uh, barbecues and meals and having family days, that sort of thing. Um, so on behalf of the Cowdries and the rest of that clan, the Thomas Eastman, etc., I'd like to thank you for welcoming me into your side of the family. Um, moving on to my side of the family, um, I haven't had an opportunity in the last...